There exists a period in our history known as the Dark Ages, a time characterized by the presence of matter and energy, yet devoid of illumination or understanding. In stark contrast, today we live in an age where the internet allows us to chronicle every aspect of our lives. We can easily log every detail and upload it to the web, where it will remain indefinitely accessible for future generations. They will have the unique opportunity to explore our experiences firsthand. Yet for us living in the present, uncovering the past is far from straightforward. We often find ourselves investing countless hours in research to piece together historical narratives. But this effort enables us to glean insights that may shape our future. Recently, researchers have begun receiving intriguing chemical data from various surfaces in space, revealing unexpected surprises within this body of research. Scientists have identified regions where entire galaxies have vanished, replaced by something entirely new. This discovery has profound implications, altering our understanding of the cosmos. Join us as we delve into the mysteries surrounding these disappearing galaxies and explore what their absence signifies for our future. One particularly captivating enigma is the Greater Unconformity, a geological puzzle that has confounded scientists for decades. This phenomenon represents a significant gap in the geological record, spanning between 100 million and 1 billion years, during which there is a near-total absence of geological activity on Earth. It is as if Earth's geological clock simply halted during this time. The thought of such a long, unrecorded period is unsettling, as we are not merely discussing a few lost years, but millions, leaving us with no insight into what transpired or how Earth rebounded. Most instances of geological mysteries rely on theories, but in this case, a wealth of evidence confirms its existence. The greater unconformity has been documented in various rock formations worldwide, manifesting differently depending on the location. Sometimes it appears as a mere blip in the timeline, while in others it spans extensive periods. It stands as one of the most significant unconformities ever identified. Intriguingly, the greater unconformity is not merely a matter of absent rocks. The geological formations that did exist during this period have largely eroded away, leaving scant evidence of their existence. The remaining rocks from this time display distinct signs of weathering and erosion, suggesting they have endured prolonged exposure to the elements. This leads us to ponder what occurred during this enigmatic chapter of Earth's history. One prevailing theory posits that the planet underwent extreme weathering and erosion, effectively obliterating pre-existing rock formations. Another theory suggests that a massive tectonic event triggered the destruction of these rocks, giving rise to new formations. Geological evidence supports the notion that Earth has experienced other significant tectonic events in the past. Similarly, the cosmos operates under its own set of mysteries. Just as the greater unconformity exists on Earth, the universe hosts the Great Void, a vast empty expanse that challenges our comprehension. This region is nearly devoid of galaxies, stars, and even dark matter. Questions arise, what events led to the disappearance of so many galaxies, and could this phenomenon be happening elsewhere in the universe? The Great Void is a perplexing phenomenon that has intrigued scientists for years. Its sheer size and emptiness render it an unusual and captivating subject for study. Located within the Aden Supervoid, this immense region stretches across nearly 1 billion light years, with the void itself estimated to span around 300 million light years, making it one of the largest voids known. While not completely empty, it is significantly less dense than surrounding areas. Researchers have been striving to understand the origins of the Great Void, proposing several theories. One suggests that primordial black holes, which formed during the universe's early moments, could have engulfed surrounding matter, leaving a vast emptiness in their wake. These black holes may have originated from tiny quantum fluctuations that expanded as the universe grew. Evidence of black holes devouring significant portions of space raises the question, could they have amassed enough power to consume entire galaxies? Another theory posits that cosmic strings hypothetical thin and incredibly dense objects formed during the universe's infancy, could have interacted with surrounding matter and gravity, pushing matter away and creating large empty regions like the Great Void. This scenario would imply that dark matter and other celestial components are unnecessary to account for the space created by this matter displacement. 
Yet another explanation for the Great Void suggests that it is merely a manifestation of cosmic variance, a phenomenon where the universe exhibits non-uniformity on a grand scale. Just as certain areas of a photograph may appear more crowded than others, some regions of the universe are naturally less populated. The Great Void could simply represent one such example of this cosmic variation. However, what if we have misjudged the universe's structure all along? The notion of an expanding universe, first proposed by astronomer Edwin Hubble in the early 20th century, observed that galaxies move away from us with increasing velocity the farther they are. This led to the realization that the universe was not only expanding but accelerating in its expansion, a startling discovery made in the late 1990s. Observations of supernovae, or exploding stars, revealed that an unknown force, dubbed dark energy, was responsible for this acceleration. The nature of dark energy remains one of the most significant mysteries in modern cosmology. As the universe continues to expand and accelerate, galaxies will eventually recede to such distances that they will appear to be moving away from us faster than the speed of light. This means that we may not only lose the ability to reach these galaxies, but we may also be unable to observe them as their light fades away, effectively disappearing from our perception altogether. The universe we inhabit consists of a vast array of galaxies, stars, planets, and celestial objects. Remarkably, the oldest light in the universe is still present today, the Cosmic Microwave Background, CMB. This radiation, discovered in the 1960s by radio astronomers Arno Pensius and Robert Wilson, serves as a remnant of the Big Bang, the event that birthed our universe approximately 14 billion years ago. The CMB is the afterglow of this colossal explosion, which created everything, including time and space. Initially, the universe was hot and dense, but as it expanded, it cooled sufficiently for the first atoms to form around 380,000 years post-Big Bang. At this point, light could travel freely through space, ultimately manifesting as the CMB we observe today. The CMB acts as a snapshot of the universe when it was just a mere 380,000 years old, providing invaluable insights into its early state. By analyzing temperature variations in the CMB, scientists have gathered crucial information about the early universe. These variations, the result of small quantum density fluctuations, were amplified by a phenomenon known as cosmic inflation, an extraordinarily rapid expansion of the universe following the Big Bang. While the CMB has illuminated many aspects of the early universe, it has also presented anomalies such as the CMB cold spot, a notably colder region within the CMB. This cold spot, approximately 70 microkelvin cooler than the average CMB temperature, spans about 5 degrees in radius, making it significantly larger than the typical fluctuations found in the primordial CMB. Various theories have emerged to explain this cold spot, ranging from statistical anomalies to the presence of supervoids or even exotic physics such as the existence of parallel universes. Additionally, the mystery of dark matter continues to challenge our understanding of the universe. Dark matter, the elusive substance comprising most of the universe, plays a crucial role in the formation of galaxies. However, some dwarf galaxies have been found to possess far less dark matter than anticipated. Researchers have identified 19 dwarf galaxies that deviate from our expectations of dark matter distribution. Traditionally, dwarf galaxies are expected to harbor substantial dark matter due to their smaller size and weaker gravity, which typically results in a greater concentration of dark matter relative to normal matter. However, these outliers challenge this notion. Scientists, including astrophysicist Kyle Oman, have been investigating how these dwarf galaxies formed and what led them to possess such minimal dark matter. Oman and his team first identified two galaxies that appeared to be lacking dark matter in 2016, followed by the discovery of two more. Now, a total of 19 dwarf galaxies have been cataloged, all within about 500 million light years of Earth. In some instances, researchers speculate that neighboring galaxies may have siphoned off their dark matter. However, the remaining galaxies are isolated, raising the question of whether they formed differently or were affected by phenomena such as exploding stars, which may have disrupted their balance of dark and normal matter. James Bullock, an astrophysicist at the University of California, Irvine, proposes that it may not be a case of missing dark matter at all, 
Perhaps these dwarf galaxies have retained their normal matter or even acquired additional quantities. This discovery underscores the diversity of galaxy forms and compels scientists to reassess existing models of galaxy evolution. Understanding dark matter and its role in galaxy formation is crucial for our comprehension of the universe as a whole, including our own Milky Way galaxy. The prospect of disappearing galaxies is a sobering one, prompting us to consider how we might prevent such occurrences in our galaxy. While the threat may not be immediate, we must remain vigilant in our efforts to understand and protect our cosmic home that as we continue to explore the vastness of space and delve deeper into the unknown, new questions emerge, challenging our understanding of the universe. One such question pertains to the fate of the universe itself. If the universe is expanding, as observations of distant galaxies and supernovae suggest, will this expansion continue indefinitely? Could the universe eventually reach a point where it stretches so far apart that all matter becomes isolated, unable to interact with other objects in the cosmos? This scenario, known as the heat death of the universe, would result in a state of maximum entropy, where all stars burn out and matter becomes evenly distributed across space. In such a universe, the passage of time would become irrelevant, as there would be no energy gradients to drive any physical processes. Another possibility for the end of the universe is the Big Rip, a theory in which the accelerated expansion of the universe, driven by dark energy, eventually tears apart all structures in the cosmos. Galaxies, stars, planets, and even atoms would be gradually ripped apart as the expansion rate exceeds the force of gravity holding these objects together. This catastrophic end, though distant in the future, raises intriguing questions about the true nature of dark energy and whether we fully comprehend its effects. While these theories about the ultimate fate of the universe are both fascinating and unsettling, the focus of current scientific inquiry is on understanding the nature of dark energy itself. Dark energy is thought to account for approximately 70% of the total energy content of the universe, yet it remains one of the most enigmatic aspects of modern cosmology. Its existence was first proposed to explain the observed acceleration of the universe's expansion. Despite its central role in the cosmos, dark energy has not been directly detected or studied, and its properties remain unknown. Some scientists speculate that dark energy could be a form of quintessence, a hypothetical energy field that permeates all of space and evolves over time. Unlike a cosmological constant, which is assumed to be static, quintessence would be dynamic and capable of changing over time, potentially leading to different phases of expansion. This concept introduces further complexities into the study of the universe's fate, suggesting that dark energy may not be a simple force acting uniformly across space, but could instead behave in unpredictable ways as the universe ages. In addition to these theoretical speculations, ongoing experiments and observations are constantly refining our understanding of the universe's fundamental forces. Large telescopes, such as the James Webb Space Telescope, have provided unprecedented views of distant galaxies, offering insight into the formation and evolution of galaxies over cosmic time. With this new data, astronomers hope to uncover the processes that govern galaxy formation and the role that dark matter and dark energy play in shaping the large-scale structure of the universe. On a more immediate scale, the discovery of exoplanets, planets outside our solar system, has opened up new frontiers in the search for life beyond Earth. Thousands of exoplanets have been discovered using various detection methods, such as the transit method, where a planet passes in front of its host star, causing a temporary dimming of the star's light. Some of these exoplanets are located in the habitable zone, the region around a star where conditions may be suitable for liquid water to exist. The discovery of Earth-like exoplanets raises the tantalizing possibility that life could exist elsewhere in the universe, perhaps even in ways we cannot yet imagine. Yet, even as we expand our search for extraterrestrial life, we must confront the profound implications of our own existence. The more we learn about the vastness and complexity of the cosmos, the more we recognize the fragile and unique nature of our planet. Earth, with its delicate balance of elements and conditions, provides the only known example of life in the universe. As we strive to understand the mysteries of the cosmos, we are also reminded of the responsibility we bear to protect and preserve our home, ensuring that future generations have the opportunity to explore the universe's wonders just as we do today. In the coming decades, 
advances in technology and space exploration will likely continue to unlock new mysteries of the cosmos. Whether through the discovery of new celestial phenomena, the refinement of our understanding of dark matter and dark energy, or the detection of signs of life on distant worlds, humanity's quest for knowledge will continue to shape our perception of our place in the universe. What we learn from these discoveries may one day determine the path our civilization takes, not only in terms of our scientific and technological progress, but also in how we approach our stewardship of the Earth and our broader role within the cosmos. The journey of exploration, both on Earth and beyond, is only just beginning, and the questions we ask today will shape the answers we find tomorrow.